small, sharp, and invasive, and zebra mussels have taken over Texas fresh bodies of water, now in 17 state lakes, and it's a problem. Earlier this summer, Canyon Lake residents had a water shortage after zebra mussels clogged up one of the main water supply intake pipes for Canyon Lake Water Service Company. The plant was temporarily shut down for intake pipes and pumps to be cleaned. Everything is back up and running now, and only residents living north of the lake are being asked to help conserve water by not watering their lawns at this time. But every time the little invaders have to get scraped off, it costs you. The costs for cleaning up those structures, the screens and the intake pipes, uh, that will get passed on to the consumer. And so we will see increased rates if the infestation is bad. Mukhtar Faruqi is a fisheries biologist with the Texas Parks and Wildlife Department. He says zebra mussels reproduce quickly and thousands of them can quickly take over lakes. He says zebra mussels can cause a handful of problems. They clog up water supply pipes, they take away food supply from local species, and they also can cause water to be foul smelling or tasting. But then they decompose and then they create a foul smelling, uh, you know, problem because then the, those people that were supplied with that water, they ended up getting smelly, uh, foul tasting water. They first invaded Texas lakes in 2009. Biologists say most likely through boats when they are not properly cleaned. Faruqi says people need to clean their boats thoroughly and let them dry for several weeks before putting them into another fresh body of water to prevent the mussels from spreading. The juveniles are microscopic. So you can't see them and they could be in any um, amount of water that's remaining in your boat. Because once they invade a lake, they are there permanently. Today, the Canyon Lake Water Service Company released a statement saying operators are actually meeting with specialized contractors this weekend to develop a plan for continued removal of those zebra mussels without having to turn the plant off. The plant is working on long-term solutions that include redesigning and enlarging the intake pipe with materials that zebra mussels can't easily attach themselves to. Myra.